Sheerness could be set to get its first town council in more than half a century. Last year, a petition with more than 600 signatures was presented to Swale Council calling for one to be set up. An information day was held at the Sheppey Gateway for residents to find out more. Brian Spohr, chairman of the town team, has been leading the campaign. We're trying to put together a Sheerness town council um, to uh, help the public, the traders, uh, to get what CNS deserves. But it includes looking after, really looking after the public, uh, what they want, what the traders want, uh, and generally just uh, trying to uh, cheer the town up. Well, we can help other people in that want to enhance CNS, such as the youth club that's always short of money, uh, the, uh, well, any, anybody that's trying to make things better for CNS. I can't impress enough that it is all for Sheerness. If it becomes reality, Sheerness Town Council will be made up of elected individuals and paid for by an increase in council tax. There's not a lot of people wanting ice creams behind me today, but fast forward to July or August and Sheerness becomes a bustling tourist hotspot. One of the powers that Sheerness Town Council would have if it happened would be to improve tourism in the area. The council would have the power to help provide community safety schemes, youth projects, improve tourism, as well as improve highways matters. I asked a few people what they thought about the idea of a town council. Sheerness gets neglected in so many ways. Eastbourne, they can spend 50 million redoing it. Sittingbourne is going crazy, having things done. We're left with the same old pound shops. Like one up here, yeah, tell people and that, yeah, definitely, because there's like so, loads, loads, there's loads of people homeless and that, and, and I think it's wrong in this cold weather and that. There are critics though, as the cost of setting up the council depends on where you live and what services would be provided, with estimates showing up to an increase of £1 a week on your tax bill. But supporters say this is worth it, as all of the money from Sheerness will go back into the town rather than being spent on other projects within Swale. If it is set up, elections will be held in May next year and there has been a massive response to questionnaires sent out so far. It's early days, we've, but we've had in the region of 1,400, so we're, we're pleased with that level of response this early. So, will Sheerness get a town council? Well, we'll just have to wait and see. This is Poppy Jeffrey for KMTV in Sheerness.